Right, I'm crouched down in the ball boy position here. Oh, shot. Look at that. Ripping it. G'day, Jenny. How are you going? I'm well, thank you. Just, uh, just uh, coming in for a bit of a hit today. Well, well I'm in a fight. Oh. I've actually been hit. What are you doing, mate? I'm <laughs> right. Down. Yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. Right, this is Jenny Krippner, tennis Morning. manager at the UQ Sport <laughs> Tennis Centre. How are you going? Just having a little warm up. Well, thank you. Right, I'm going to try and crouch down and ask you a few questions. Tennis stuff a bit later, but uh, I want to know a bit, a little bit more about you. What's the one movie that makes you cry? Oh, uh, I reckon, I reckon you can probably always go with The Lion King for me, to be honest. That's like the third um, time someone said that. I'm a bit of a child, I know. I think everyone would answer that. It's just, it's just too sad. Mufasa <laughs> just dies. It's too much for me to handle. All right, I'll, we'll move on before you start tearing yeah, up. Tom's here whipping balls in, hello mate. Gets me uh, time. Work on your short game, but um, who's the most famous person you've ever met? Um, oh, that's tough. I almost met Jeffrey Rush once, um, almost, at a rowing regatta. When you say almost, um, <laughs> was he in he the vicinity actually, and you bailed out? Or? No, he was, being, he was a parent at the, um, at the regatta and um, yeah, he was there with his kid and I thought it best to let not, him let him have his private time. Not uh, disturb him. Hey, if you, you, you're on, this is a bit morbid, but you're on death row. You've been given one final meal. Oh! <laughs> I've been hit one final meal. One final meal on death row. What would you choose? Oh. I'm gonna have to go with gnocchi. Really? I, I love my carbs. Um, yeah, gnocchi definitely. So do I. Any sauce, just as long as there's gnocchi involved. Hey, you can listen to one album on repeat. For the rest of your life, what would you choose? Um, I want to get good value. I reckon if it's going to be on repeat, so I'd probably have to go something with a hundred songs or so. Maybe, maybe a uh, best of best hundred road tripping songs. I'm going to go with <laughs> one of those servo CDs. Bit of, yeah, sing a bit of Whitney along the way. Bit of Whitney. Get uh, my value. And finally, what's the most romantic thing you've ever done? I'm down here on one knee. That's pretty. Oh quite dear, romantic. that's a proposal and a half. Yeah. Um, Look, I'm more of a day-to-day -day romance person. <laughs> I, uh, I fought the odd flowers for my partner while I was away, but you know, it's the little bits that count here and there. We're getting some laughter here from the uh, <laughs> from the peanut gallery. <laughs> I don't John, think. Back, right, a couple of tennis-related questions for you, and look pretty oh. handy in your short game here. When did you get into tennis, and how, how did that come about? Um, for you? Look, it was quite a while ago when I was a little youngster in primary school. I started playing. Um, bit of a hiatus through high school, but got back into it when I came back to uni, so... Yeah, nice. Yeah. And what, talking about your tennis game, what's your strengths <laughs> and weaknesses? I can't serve, I'm an absolute um, disgrace. My enthusiasm is a strength. <laughs> <laughs> my weakness is my skill levels, but I will endeavour to get to the tennis ball, get to the ball where I can. But get to the ball. it doesn't always, doesn't it, always go in. Put it into practice. Or over the net. Look, there's a, oh. it's, a, it's a real smorgasbord of tennis that you can get involved in here. What are some of your favourite programs for people to get involved in? Oh, look, there's one you're going to always love to hate is cardio tennis. Um, very good fun. What's cardio tennis in a nutshell? Very cardio quickly. tennis. So it's a lot of running around, footwork on court. There's some, there's some tennis and hitting involved, but the coaches will basically make you run push-ups here and there. You've got to also try and hit the ball, which is the hardest bit, but... It's good fun, good group environment, lots of people, good stuff. Now, I've, I've made a return of tennis myself. <laughs> I'm awful, I can't backhand. It, I'm, I'm normally hitting it out of the stadium, more like Barry Bonds. Oh, how how right. can I improve? What, what would you suggest a, a pleb tennis player like me do to try and get better <laughs> down here? Um, look, I'm going to recommend maybe a coaching program. I don't think I should... Uh, give you too much specific feedback but the group coaching programs for adults that we have are pretty fun um, come along of a night after work and get some advice from our expert coaches like this guy here you sure he's um, an expert he's more expert yeah than, than most um, right. but definitely and as yep. a bonus I'm gonna oh, leapfrog out. the court right. and I'm gonna let you try and smash one and hit me and I won't move <laughs> we'll just see how close you can go Oh, <laughs> swing at your volley, Jenna. Alright, reasonably close. 
Oh, oh, that's neat. Oh, that was painful. Right, okay, I'm out of here before we, <laughs> before I lose the limb. Thank you very much for that. You're welcome. And can you give us a big Leighton Hewitt come on to finish? Come on! <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs>